this whole process. So, so the mechanics of this is this. You see how I'm on my back. Steve needs to kind of roll me up on my shoulder blades a bit. Yes, and now rotate me. One way, one me. Rotate me. Yes. You see how he can now get through? He pushed me up on my shoulders, so this is like pushing my knees in, into my shoulders. Good. Push, and I rotate the the other way. Do you see how much rotation there is? When the person on the bottom is playing guard, this is how engaged the body is. One more time. So he needs to, see how I'm on my lower back? Yes, right there, yeah, yeah, yeah. you will be up on the shoulders. Because I don't want that. Otherwise, yeah, because otherwise, if he keeps pushing my knees into my head like this, he just push me over my shoulder and then, you know, because then I'm, I'm not even playing guard. This is not even a, you know, I don't know what that is. Stretch lap, like junior, okay? If the legs are all like this and he's going in and out and the legs are really, you know, I mean, th this is not even a guard. The whole thing a guard is to protect the other person, you know, the, the person from their ability to pass your guard, okay? So here, he wants to push my knees into my shoulders. Yes, and now he can rotate me. One way, all the way. Okay, so this is how you need to be here, good. And here now, he can step through with his right foot, takes knee to the belly, this hand goes, and he goes hip, knee, shoulder. Behind the head, behind the head. yes, yeah, 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 yeah. There we go right there. Okay, one more time. From the side. See how my lower back's on the mat? He drives me forward. Yes. Okay. And now rotate me one way. Rotate. Yes. Rotate. Yes, get your elbows. Yes, 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 yes. Look at that. Look. Yeah, look. You even got past that one. Okay. Do you see how that rotation enabled them to get past the guard? Now, why did that happen? It's because I'm trying to engage my legs to connect. Okay, because usually this happens. But he doesn't want this to happen or this to happen. So he keeps pushing the knees up, 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 because then my legs are dangling. Now it'll take me one way or another. One, the other way. Yeah, 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 yeah. And his elbows, look, okay, I'm trying to put my feet on the hips and his elbows are just flaring out. Yes. Yeah, look, right there. Look. Yeah, and now walk through. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. Does that make sense? Good, Steve, you watch the boy come in. So yes, the person on the bottom is gonna need to use the core. So from here, and you're using your elbows to protect. Yes, and I start driving these. Yes, good, and I start rotating. Yes, yes. So you're the opposite, yes. Okay, one push, yeah. Good, you go. Yeah, that was a good rotation. Okay. What I want is I want to take the slap out of here and I want to go here. As I push this up, I'm pulling this. This is I'm steering. Okay? If I'm going the same direction with both, I'm pushing. I need to push just enough to where he's engaged. I need to steer it. Steer it. And keep my his feet off my knees. He wants his feet off on my on my head. But here, I want to take the slack out. So as he's trying to put his feet on my hips, I can keep it away. He comes over. See how you use that? Flaring up. Okay. Hip comes under. Bring back forward. Does that make sense? Okay. So the bottom person has got to keep their coin game. So, uh, put your head up. If I try to do it here, it's hard to do. If this happens, because his knees go past the hip line. If I can get this right, can I see this? He's very weak. Yep. Because if I can do this, that's just a throw by. So you have to combine it. You can't be just all, you can't just for practice. But as I turn them up, 
Do it this way. Maybe if you want to put the front on here. I don't need to draw that one. Do the step through, and then you can combine it with the others. 